my house is a mess as you can see there is crap everywhere so I'm gonna show you how I can quickly clean it up this is life for me I have little kids I have a business to run I look after you guys on the mum two pages and I'm lazy I'm really really lazy I if I don't want to do something I won't so that's just how it is that's why I like to be organized I like to have systems in place that uh, really help me from becoming overwhelmed and getting into a state so I'm going to show you how I'm going to clean this up watch the video if you've got any questions I'll be happy to answer them this is part one the crap box I'm going to chuck all the crap that doesn't belong here in this box and then when I'm finished and everything looks pretty I'm going to take the crap and I'm going to put it where it belongs a bit crude but it works when I come across washing, I'm literally just going to throw it on the floor there and when I'm done again, I'm going to pick that laundry pile up and pop it in the machine. Got some recyclables here. I'm going to make a pile of the recyclables and I'm going to put them in the recycling bin once I'm finished. If I do it in little steps like this, I'm finding it's a lot easier to manage, I'm not walking all over the place. And while I'm here, I'm going to do some steps. So I've got some stuff here. This is a shoe basket and I try to keep it up to date with just the shoes we're wearing at the moment. So it's a bit out of control. So so these are going to go into my kids' two small box. This is going to go in their hats and shoes box. And these are going to go in my drawer. But for now, they are crap, so they're going in the crap basket. See how I don't want to walk out of the area too many times, even though the house is small, I want to condense it, I, I, you know, my time. Right, I'm going to get the floor cleaner. While I'm there, I'm going to pick up these and I'm going to take them to the laundry because that's where the floor cleaner is. Crosswave, love of my life. Go to vacuum and mop the floors. Okay, so that's a dry vac that I've done. It's a pretty good vacuum cleaner alone, even though it's made to uh, wet vac. So I'm now going to use some water on the rug. It will leave marks on the tires, but because I haven't done the floors yet, that'll get cleaned up as I do the tires. I'm done with the floors for just this little section. So now I'm going to deal with the crap basket. I'm going to pick that up and then I come back and I'll, it should probably only take me less than a minute and to throw this bit of rubbish out. So I will do that now. I hope you enjoyed that. I got an empty crap bucket, pretty dry floors. I can move on to my next area now.